welcome to my Easter weekend vlog, you guys. It's Saturday morning, all ready for a soul cycle class. I'm actually shocked at the group of us that we rallied to go together. Like so many of our family and boyfriend's friends are coming. It's gonna be so good. I actually got in yesterday afternoon and Lucy and I went to Pilates together. Do you wanna come in? Come on, oh, vlogging. I can insert clips right here from when we went to Solid Core. It was so good. I feel sore. I always oh, say yeah. it feels like my body's covered in bruises after Solid Core in my stomach. I was laughing this morning and I was like, ow. <laughs> What else did we do? We just like hung out last night, big group of us. It was so fun. Being social, you know? Yeah. And then now everyone's tired. Pulling it together. I could just roll it out of bed. <laughs> and Mandy's gonna wear the green set I wore to Pilates yesterday. Cause she was like, all my workout sets are dirty. And I didn't wash them. And I'm like, honestly, this is probably gross cause I wore this yesterday, but like, I don't sweat that much in solid core. Like I just sweat in like full cycle, you know, like more cardio. Yeah, I know, so I, I was like, go ahead girl. I didn't realize you were the So we're both doing set. Wait, I have a, my turquoise one, but you're gonna we really be able to tell I'm sweating. Yeah, like certain colors. Mm -hmm. So we have Soul Cycle this morning. There's literally gonna be a ton of us. Oh, my friend KP is coming, and I'm so excited to see her. Mm -hmm. And then oh, we have like drinks tonight at Ohika. If you guys have ever been to Ohika Castle, I think it's in Huntington near here. I've never been. I'm so excited. You never been? No, I missed it when you guys went. Oh my gosh, I think okay, it's so cool. And now that my friend Brooke, she got married there, I just think it's even more cool. And I. I didn't know her when she got married, but all her pictures and stuff, so I'm just gonna think of her. It's such a cool place. We're getting drinks there, and then we're gonna get dinner after, bring you guys along the whole day. And tomorrow's Easter. Yeah, my mom's coming. That's the whole thing. <laughs> JK, she changed out of the green. Wearing the dirty black, does it smell like? Which that sounds like. Sweat. <laughs> um, this this is just plain the, black. We love. And like, then a different black. And mine is just like I dark bluish gray. gray. Wait, okay, also we have to ask you guys. I feel like this is an unpopular opinion. Man and I were saying we like our leggings to be like, like so tight. Yeah. You do too? Mm -hmm. Okay, then maybe it's not a popular opinion. Because I feel like no, everyone. Doesn't. Yeah, like most girls are like, no, I don't want it tight. Like, that's uncomfortable. But I'm specific to like, if I'm working out, I want it skin tight. But then, like, during the day, maybe a little looser. Like, just like cozy yeah. align leggings with like a sweatshirt. What size you know? are yours? But I like extra tight for a workout. Got some cinnamon rolls going. Nothing like a pre soul cycle cinnamon roll <laughs> to get it going. <laughs> look how good these look. Easter bunny shirt. Showed up. No, 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 sit. Okay, maybe you get like a tiny little place. <laughs> I'm so bad these days. <laughs> okay, down, give them some tricks. There you go. Uh-uh, down. Good boy. Sit, sit, come. Okay, good boy. <laughs> Do you want some? I didn't even show you guys. We stopped at Starbucks. I got brown sugar, oat milk shake, and espresso. I'm like shaking in my boots and I already had a little coffee earlier. So yeah, I'm gonna be shaking all day in the sugar, but it's so good. So it was so fun. Feeling very sweaty, now I'm cold. You know, the sweat dries and you're like freezing. Look at how cute you guys also. All the little Easter decorations. My Aunt Chris is so cute. Oh, don't look at Gritty, but. <laughs> okay. Gritty is not a part of <laughs> this cutie girl. Aw. <laughs> Just giving you guys like a tour. Ew, Brody has ripped it. <laughs> They are so happy. Back together. Oh yeah. But first, what you guys do bagels. Look how good all this looks. Aww. You are the first baby dog. Look at this happy guy. Oh, Bodie's jealous. <laughs> Bodie, is this your buddy? He's like, there's bagels around. That's all I want. Look at this. Hello. Yum. Everything bagel, scallion cream cheese, gravlock, tomato, capers, and onion. Mmm, that's gonna be so good. Mandy has some egg dyeing going on. Tell us about your eggs. Are these ones supposed to be in halfway? I don't know, Sean did them. Oh, they're gonna, oh, maybe on purpose, like they'll be like half and half. Are you gonna eat them? Yeah. Wow, this is so festive of us.
ready. Just got to throw on my little blazer I'm going to wear. There's a lot happening. <laughs> Samir's kind of dirty. But I'm wearing this leather corset I just got in Revolve from that brand like M-I-A-O-U, something like that. Not meow. Can someone tell me how to pronounce that? I don't know. But I love her. It's kind of like snug. So I feel like it's making boobs exist that aren't there. But then from the side, it's like <laughs> flattening them. Anyway, and then these jeans I just got on Revolve as well. They're a Goldie. I love them. And I got a darker wash. And I was like, Lucy or Mandy, if you guys will wear these, keep them. And Lucy said they're too tight on her butt. And they look really cute on Mandy. They're more like baggy in her because she's teeny. But they're like the loose kind of vibe. So she's going to keep them. And they look really cute. Okay, I'm putting my boots and my little blazer. And we're going to head to Rika. Her. Okay, tell us what you said about Capricorn. If you couldn't tell, Mandy's a Capricorn. Gold digger. Yeah. Cold digger? yeah no, Is that what they say? No, Capricorn's just that Capricorn's like money. money. That's like a known thing. Which that's you do. But I don't think that's like your bottom Taurus line. Is to be like materialistic. I don't think like yeah. Oh yeah. I don't hate it no, I think Taurus and Capricorn just like nice yeah. things in life. Would be nice. You know? <laughs> we literally just ran into the owner at the bar, you guys, and he was saying how like 30 or 40 years ago he bought it for 1.4 million then a couple years later like renovated it all like fixed it up and sold it for like 22. Like what the heck? But this place is insane. He did such a good job, clearly. Just had a photo shoot. Look how pretty. It's not a picture, it's a video. <laughs> I got to see what you do. <laughs> you have like a silent pose. Like how cool it is in here. What the heck? We just went exploring. Like so cute. I'm back to my same old drink. If you ever come here, you guys, just get this, okay? It's delicious. That's all you need to know. Yum. Look at that. Oh, those meatballs look so good. Say that again. I'm really working. You, but the way you said it, you said I need. I need a chocolate mousse cake and Shawnee's a cheesecake. No, but you said in Shawnee's a cheesecake. He loves cheesecake. That's his favorite. And your mom goes, I need a biscotti. Biscotti with cannoli. A warm biscotti. Yum. Look at that one. Yeah, really you handled it very well. Got some chocolate cakes and cheesecake. Wait, what's this called? Cannoli. Back from dinner. We had the best time, you guys. Just Ohika is like so special. I know I was like filming a bunch on my phone, but it's just so cool there. If you've never been in the drinks, I was getting those purple ones were so good. Like the yummiest ever. And then we went to Piccolo something. I think it was called for dinner. Italian. It was so good. And we did like family style. We got like a chicken piccata, vodka sauce pasta, like everything. And I know I showed like some. I didn't even show the vodka sauce pasta because I like ate it so quick. More than that, just going to dinner with like a big group of people and just like the best vibes. Like it was so fun. I feel like we we're all just laughing so much, like telling stories. I love like fun conversations. Like we were all talking about dreams that we had and like reoccurring dreams and like stuff like that. And just like old memories, like funny stuff and like crazy. It was just really fun. It was like the best night. I just took off my booties. It feels like when you take off your like skates or your ski boots or something, you know, I'm like, they're worth it. They are quite uncomfortable, but they're so cute. You can insert a picture of like my full outfit here. I didn't even show you guys. I know I showed you like this and this, but I didn't show you the blazer. Or into the shoes, whatever. But I want to shout out the sponsor of the video. This is a perfect sponsor for this video because I feel like I'm having such a good hair day right now. Like this turned out so so good. And it all started with this, my Way Detox shampoo, you guys, because my hair was so sweaty and like just dirty. It had like so much product buildup in it after Soul Cycle, and this just is like such a good reset for your scalp. You guys know this, my holy grail. Gone through a hundred bottles of the Way Detox shampoo. It's just the most clarifying shampoo, like the best clarifying shampoo ever. And I fill up this cute little mini one that I got. I thought this is so cute to show you guys if you didn't know I had the mini. And yeah, I'll just fill up this little container for about a month ago. It's the best shampoo ever. You could like dumble cleanse with this. You guys know I also love their anti-dandruff one because I have such a dry freaking scalp that's like flaky. So that's really good too. Then the way leaving conditioner. Also just like look how cute these little things are. These little minis that I got. I cannot get a brush through my hair without it. You guys saw me when I got out of the shower and I was brushing through. It's always like really tangled because I have such 
such fine hair. And another thing that I've been using since I have such fine hair, I forgot to bring it, but I actually have been traveling with this to the full size because I've been so good at being so consistent with it. I can insert like a clip of it right here. Their scalp serum, which I've also gotten my bestie Hannah onto. We're both like hooked on that since we have naturally such like fine kind of delicate hair and it really helps support like the scalp health overall and helps you grow like thicker, fuller, healthier hair, which is what we're both looking for. And it just feels really nice on your scalp. So I feel like because of that, I'm noticing like, I don't know, I'm having a good hair day. It just looks really nice curled and I feel like my hair can look very like fine and everything. I've also been so good with their treatment mask, which is also so hydrating. My hair is feeling like really soft and nice and everything. They're the best products ever. I feel like also one of the things that my hairdresser always tell me, he's like literally the number one question I get asked about you as your hairdresser is people are always like, okay, does she have extensions? Like how can her hair be that long? She's dyed it since she was nine years old. Like literally bleached my hair since I was nine years old. Fun fact, you guys don't know that. And he was like, no, no, no. Like it is her hair. Like it's all hers. Like no extensions, nothing. And she, <laughs> I think I'm blessed. Thank you, mom. My mom and my sister have like the thickest, like nicest hair. So I feel like I have really good hair genes, but I also take care of it and use like really nice products. So I feel like a way is a really big part of that, how I can keep my hair looking like healthy and nice, even though I bleach it like crazy, which is quite damaging. So I will have way linked down below for you guys. My code is stay the same. If you go to theway.com, that's T-H-E-O-U-A-I.com. Use my code GG, you will get 15% off your entire purchase. Don't forget, as always, my code is GG for 15% off. My most favorite hair care products, you guys know, I literally have all of them. They're all tried and true. I love them all. And these are really like my go-to minis that I travel with that I cannot live without. Like I can't travel without them or I'd have to go pick them up somewhere else because like my hair needs these. So yes, okay. I need to get out of this course and I can't breathe after eating so much talent. I'm gonna be real. We're all sitting there. I was like, oh my gosh, I can't breathe. I have stomach ache. <laughs> these luckily are good sitting jeans. Like I feel like they're more like baggy. I have some in the way it's like I can eat Italian, but I never ever have like, I feel like I'm so behind on the corset. Like this is probably one of like the only corsets I have. I might have like one more, but I never wear them. And I know they're like obviously supposed to be like tight around, but like I didn't realize just how tight they are. And I feel like I can't breathe if I eat a lot. <laughs> just happened to you guys. My mom was like, maybe you should go up a size. And I'm like, yeah, but I thought they were like supposed to be tight. I don't know. <laughs> maybe they're just not meant for an Italian dinner. Anyway, I gotta put on my gummy gloves. <laughs> hear the camera turn on and you got really cute. I literally turned the camera on and he like looked over. Look at his legs. I'm like spooning him. Are you the so day. happy? <laughs> oh, that is so nice. You love me, Andy. That is the best when he'll spoon with you. Are you cuddling? You're so happy. probably <laughs> Is your singing voice warmed up? <laughs> and oh, here's our little cue. Church was a success. Lots of singing. I'm not kidding. My I'm gonna have a sore throat from singing. By the end, I was like, my voice hurts. <laughs> now we're getting coffee. I'm so excited. This place looks cute. I've never been in here before. How cute is in here, you guys? I don't know why, but this carrot cake is speaking to me. Also, Sierra. What? Yum. And their menu looks so good. They have so many different kinds of coffee. Okay. In case anyone's wondering, I got a iced vanilla latte, light vanilla with oat milk, and it's really good. It kind of just tastes like oat milk, but it's still really good. <laughs> I don't really taste the espresso, but I like. I think I need to try your iced chai. Is it really good? Yeah, it's good. <laughs> it's going for a stroll. <laughs> That's a really good chai. It's like just the right amount of like spice. Yeah, I feel like a lot of places be too spicy. It's really good. Just a little kick. Mm -hmm. I'm laughing, you guys, because let's see if it will stay. I literally have my camera propped up on like you know like a sliding door like handle, so it's like this skinny. I don't know. My camera's staying up. Cross your fingers. I wanted to show you my outfit that I wore to church, and I guess like my Easter outfit that I'm wearing today. And I thought it was so bright in here. There's my plants. This is like a mini like jungle greenhouse moment in my aunt and uncle's house. But I thought it was so fun in here. Anyway, so whatever you guys saw, I recently got from Jenny Kane my most favorite ever. The cocoon cardigan and I wear it open, close, whatever. This is like the taupe color. I've had it in the oatmeal color for years. And it's one of my most favorite worn pieces, like a forever piece, you know? Like I'll wear it literally forever. And then these leather pants I got a while ago from Revolve. They're just like cream leather pants. I actually love them because they're so baggy 
And so they're so comfy and just like relaxed looking. So when I wear these, like a, like two oversized pieces, I just feel like so comfortable. My little penny sneakers. Here we have it. <laughs> Show them how you go swimming. Go swimming. <laughs> Where are you going? Oh, look at you go. <laughs> Is it cold? <laughs> I'm home. Mm. Hello. And I was about to take off my clothes, but then I remembered to vlog first because I'm about to get in the shower with Brody since he went swimming in the ocean. Yeah, we had so much fun. I was throwing sticks for him and he would jump in and swim out. He's a little sandy and a little salty. And a little sweet. He looks so tired. You don't make him take but a bath right It's now. bath time, bud. Your favorite. We'll just do a quick one. Hey, it's hey. funny because I rinsed him with like the hose and he really doesn't look that bad, but I just, you know, got you you guys watching, you know what I mean? When they're like all in the salt water, I think it's better to just soap them up a little. <laughs> His favorite spot, laying on the couch like half belly up sideways. Max is watching the Masters. It's very cozy vibes in here. I'm loving it right now. I had the slider ropes in all afternoon. Did you really? Mm -hmm. Yeah, like it's so nice and cozy in here. I'm gonna miss this place when we move out. Like, you hear the birds chirping? I think that was a bird on the TV. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> okay, never mind. But you do hear But birds. you do hear the birds here. Yeah, but I think in that moment, that was Okay, I, that's really funny. Okay, I'm being exposed. That was a lie. <laughs> Fake news. <laughs> but, um, yeah. Unfortunately, sir, your resting time is up. Oh, but he's so sleepy. Because it's time for a bath. He hates it. <laughs> it's actually gotten better with them. He's better with the blow dryer too. Come on, sir. Are you better with the blowout, sir? Yeah. <laughs> this is so good in the bath. Yeah. Are you only a little mad? You got a lot of treats. You want some more treats? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go get him more treats. He's being so good. Boy. <laughs> oh, are we doing it into pieces? <laughs> we made dinner, you guys. And this is so fun of us. I feel like normally we have the same thing, but we actually made two different things tonight because I just want to try like a pesto pasta moment. I did some spinach in there as well. I would do tomatoes and like basil and stuff, but we don't have that. But I still feel like it'll be really good. Get some Parmesan cheese, crushed red pepper, and then Max did his HelloFresh, which now I have FOMO. And I'm gonna eat some of his because it looks so good. We love that one too. That's the bulgogi meatballs, I think is how you say it. Mmm, 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 mmm. Are you clean, puppy? <laughs> He's still like dry and back here. <laughs> it's the next morning. I just got back from Orange Theory a bit ago. And the last thing I vlogged last night was our dinner, which. By the way, Max's tasted so much better than mine. I ended up eating a bunch of his. I think that's why we always cook the same thing because we cook different things and his will look better to mine. Like someone else's food always looks better than my own. Do you guys agree with that? So then I just want to eat his. But no, they were both good. I just like really wanted to try this like pesto recipe thing I saw on TikTok. But mine was still good. I'm being dramatic. Anyway, that was last night. Watched a little Survivor, went to bed. Also, you guys, did I just say I went to Orange Air this morning? I'm all over the place. Okay, I woke up. I literally woke up. In the middle of the night and I was like did I somehow like hit my eye while I was sleeping did Max like roll over because I don't know if you guys have like boyfriends or husbands or whatever that guys like twitch so much and move around so much in their sleep and Max has never like hit me <laughs> while we're sleeping but I feel like sometimes he'll like move and like his arm will like run it do you know what I mean anyway I was like did he accidentally somehow punch me in the eye because <laughs> I woke up my eye like it woke me up in the night is what I'm trying to say my eye hurts so bad specifically this one when I touch it it feels like swollen and like a bruise but like it's not bruised like both of them kind of ache though and they're both so bloodshot but especially this one what the heck if you guys have followed me for a while or like have seen like a lot of my recent videos i feel like i've mentioned this here and there that like dealing with such red eyes and also like itchy like painful what is going on like i'm sure it could be allergies like i've always had a sensitivity like pollen and stuff it's spring but i'm like what they weren't bothering me during the day at all and i just woke up and they were so bad this one hurt is it from being on my screen a lot? I mean, probably that doesn't help. I was on my phone a bunch before I got into bed. But, like, I feel like while I was sleeping, it wouldn't have gotten worse. My eyes are so bad today. Like, I look unwell. 
<laughs> like what's going on i'm sure all of you will be like oh allergies you're on your phone like sensitivity stuff like that like i used lucy's mascara which i always use my own but then i don't think it could be that at all because my eyes were not bothering me at all yesterday during the day I took it off completely and then it wasn't until i woke up this morning anyway <laughs> probably shouldn't like web md it it'll say something scary but i need to just take care of them also because i've been dealing with red eyes like you guys don't care sorry i'm just like chatting one here at the end but since i've been dealing with redness in my eyes for the past couple months i feel like i've been using lumify a ton and i feel like i literally can't do my makeup now without using lumify those whitening eye drops which by the way they're so expensive i ran out the other day and ran to cvs and got them it was like 30 dollars for a bottle i'm like wow i didn't remember that these were so expensive and i've been using them every day and i think like people are telling me that that's also not good and that can also irritate your eyes but then it's like a bad cycle because my eyes are red so i want to use a lumify but if lumify is making my eyes red then i want to use more lumify to make them brighter looking so what do i do <laughs> anyway enough about my <laughs> issues um i had the best easter weekend this was like the funnest vlog it's so much fun it went by so quick but yeah we just had the best time with fam did i even vlog my mother i feel like no i was thinking about that while i was there i'm like i never show my mom but also she never wants to be on video she's like don't film me don't put me on video so i want to like respect that but then it's like did you even see her she looked so cute when she got there she drove on saturday and she was wearing like the cutest like pink and not pink purple like light purple and white striped top and i feel like she got her hair like blown out i'm like your hair looks so good you look so cute she's glowing she just looked really good so yeah it was just like so good to see her we celebrated her birthday early i didn't even show any of that but i literally got her birthday presents like four months ago right after christmas because i knew what i wanted to get her like ever since christmas i was like oh i should have gotten this and then i got it for her birthday we had so much fun it was the best time is all i'm trying to say and now i want to go home and visit my mom again because i feel like i didn't get enough time with her so yes love you guys thank you for watching this vlog and i'll see you in my next one